Well, welcome to my channel, Get Go TV. And in this video, I have a multi-wrench, an antique wrench that uh, it looks like to be a combination of a hammer. It's got a claw on it, a hammer on one side, and it's a monkey wrench on the other side. And if you look at it real close, it's rusted shut. And the little wheel that's on there is rusted shut and it will not turn, it's seized up. And I don't know, it's hard to say how long it's been that way, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a video on restoring this wrench and trying to get it all freed up and get all the uh, rust off of it and make it function and turn it back to new again. That's what it looks like on the other side. And that's what it looks like on this side. So, First thing I'm gonna do is, uh, is we're gonna go ahead on and I'm just gonna make a very fast video with some subtitles, but what is it? I'm gonna put it in a rust remover and then I'm gonna soak it in some, some stuff, maybe some WD-40 or something to try to break it loose. And then once we can separate it into separate pieces, if we can get it broke loose and function, and then I'll go ahead on and start stripping the rust off of it and shaping it back up and making it into the tool it was when it was made. I'm not sure who made this wrench, as I do not see a maker's mark. But you may end up seeing it when we start removing some of the rust off of it. And that's what it looks like right now. And it is froze up solid. It does not move. It is rusted shut. So it's a neat little wrench. I'm sure it's kind of rare and unusual. You don't see them too much. There's some pitting and stuff in the head of the hammer. And I'm gonna go ahead on there and uh, stop put stop by taking it and putting it in some rust remover and see what see what that does.